Page 24 is an example of an evol evolving, rather, uh, myocardial infarct. Let's see if we can get this to move over here. There we go. Okay, so um, again, we'll look at lead groupings. And uh, if we look at leads 2, 3, and AVF, uh, what we see here is uh, ST elevation and T wave inversion. Uh, here we see a Q wave, ST elevation, and T wave inversion. And in AVF, we see um, Q wave, possibly some ST elevation, and T wave inversion. So here we have signs of uh, necrosis, of injury, and ischemia. And this, is, this means that uh, because we have evidence of necrosis, this means that this is an MI that's been going on for some time. We don't know how long, probably less than 24 hours. But it, it's, it's an evolving MI, meaning that it's got uh, all three components. And uh, so it would be important to elicit a history and determine from the patient's perspective when this chest pain started uh, so we can determine whether this is a, a patient who uh, is a STEMI that can go straight to a PCI center.